evening viewers welcome to our glory globe tv viewers most amazing news yes archaeologists have linked rising and lowering sea levels in the atlantic ocean to the yefs and flows of ancient civilizations in southern brazil the findings incorporated several lines of past archaeological evidence and suggest even large resilient and cooperative coastal communities can easily go out with the tide when analyzing and dating a series of prehistoric cell mountains known as sambacuis in the local language researchers noticed some significant changes in the southwestern brazil about 2500 years ago at this time the size and frequency of sambacu sites suddenly began to decrease possibly indicating the dissolution of what were for millennia dense and stable selfish eating population other research in the area has also identified a rapid reduction in sambacuis around this time but some researchers think these changes mostly occurred from the rise of a ceramics and crops the use of this new technology mean populations did not need to rely as much on fish or molluscs leading to a reduction in cell piles however the study which was published in december 2021 found the decline of cell mediates started before the introduction of pottery so why then were sambacu practices abandoned the answer might have to do with an extreme retreating tide by reassessing human and animal remains from babitonga bay home to brazil's largest concentration of sambacus researchers have put forward a new timeline according to more than 400 radiocarbon dates the spread of ceramics in babitonga probably started around 1200 years ago a decline of sambacu activities on the other hand started much earlier around 2500 years ago before leading to dramatic abandonment about 2200 years ago at this time known as the late holocene pollen sedimentary and geochemical data from the bay show significant changes in coastal and marine ecosystems cold fronts in southern brazil were becoming more common and as more water began to turn to ice sea levels were also retreating by a thousand year ago sea levels in southern brazil had dropped 1.6 meters from their peak about 7000 years ago this led to significantly more dry lands and mangrove systems which probably impacted the availability of subtidal molluscs fishing grounds and edible plants prehistoric populations that once relied so heavily on these foods had to suddenly compete for dwindling resources this event possibly represent a turning point in the community based and resource pooling nature of large ceremonial tribes which would have become unsustainable in most areas the author of the page suggested yeah as a result several nucleated groups would have dissolved into smaller dispersed and relatively independent socially units organized a short lived residential and logistics settlement that had notoriously less visible archaeologically bien the report glory globe tv delhi bharat